everyone and welcome back to the Winfield Public Library's programming. Today we are going to be making egg carton flowers. So all you need is one, one egg carton does about four flowers. Uh, it depends on how many petals you want to give that flower. And you're going to need some glue, either hot glue or Elmer's glue, and you will need some paint. You, I use spray paint, but I also use some watercolors. I can use acrylics. Pretty much any kind of paint will work for this project. So go ahead, grab your supplies. If you live close to the Winfield Public Library, you can pick up a craft kit from Miss Nucha. And let's go get started. So for our egg carton flowers, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start by just cutting out a bunch of these. You don't have to be super careful because we'll be cleaning them up in a moment. Maybe this will rip off much better. Okay, we will need this for the interior part of the flower. And these are going to be the bigger petals. Now that I got all those separated, now we can shape them up. And I'm kind of making four petals. Now my egg cartons, some will be more obvious than others. This does need to be a cardboard egg carton. We're gonna just kind of open it up a little bit. Don't worry if your shapes get a little bit jagged. That's gonna make them look a little bit more realistic. We can see there's my first petal. That one looks pretty good. So let's move on to the next. Now in this egg carton, I'm not getting four very obvious petals. So I kind of have to split the one side to make that happen. And you can see we're going to start to stack them once we're ready. Once you think you have enough of these cut, now we're going to take this section here to roll up for the inside. And we're just going to tightly roll that and it's going to go inside. You could kind of make this a little bit of a wavy line. I might want the bottom a little bit shorter and not so even. So now when I roll it, it's looking a little bit more like that. So now that I have these shapes, we can go ahead and we can start to glue them. So you can either use just like a regular Elmer's glue or hot glue 
Um, the hot glue will dry faster, which may be better, um, but it doesn't really matter. So I'm just gonna start to layer them. You can see I'm not putting them like that, or I'm kind of staggering them. So press it down. Hold it for a moment. And we're also gonna be shaping the petals. We're gonna be kind of working them a little bit, trying to make them look a little bit more realistic. We can also go and glue inside of the petals. Kind of hold them where we want them. And I'm going to do my next. Again, staggering it. And then when you have enough layers, we're going to be putting the middle in. I also want these center ones to start to kind of like it's like blooming open. There we go. I'm pretty happy with how that looks now. Now, if you use wet glue like this, I recommend you let it dry before you paint it. Or if you use hot glue, you can go ahead and we can paint it right away. You can either use spray paint or acrylic. Pretty much anything you want. So now that I'm done with two, you can go ahead and make as many as you want. And you can see this one, I did four layers of the petals before I put it in the middle. This one, I did three. I would say if you're doing a bunch of these to make a wreath, do some three, some four, some five, because that's going to make it look more realistic. So I'm actually going to take these outside with some white spray paint, and I'm going to spray paint them. So I'm ready to start spray painting them. Make sure you don't accidentally spray paint your puppy. So I think they're looking pretty cool. It does absorb a bunch of the paint, which is why I wanted to do the spray paint because I figured if I was just doing acrylic, it would take forever. So I'm liking how these are looking. I'm thinking, what if I drip some more liquidy red paint on there? Why not? It's an art project. Let's make it artsy. I'm gonna put some red liquid color on there. That works pretty well. I also have some gold. So let's go ahead and try. The most important thing about art is playing. I didn't know how this was going to look before I tried. And honestly, I might actually prefer the white flowers and that's okay. It's okay to play and see which ones, you know, you don't always have to find the right answer right away. Also the paper egg cartons, they absorb so much paint. So I think I prefer the spray paint, even though it absorbed a lot. And I think now that I look at this one, it needs more in the middle. So I'm just going to put a little bit of glue and put it right there in the middle. There we go. That helps a little bit. You can always edit, add things as you see. Art is about editing. I'm just gonna do, just a little bit. And you know what, I'm gonna spray a little bit 
like I said, I liked the white, but you know what? I think I kind of like where the pink peeks through a little bit. I'm pretty happy with that. So just play until you find a place you're happy. And then you can make a bunch of these, put them on a wreath, put them on a frame, or you could just put them on your table. So I hope you had fun making your egg kern flowers with me. I think they turned out pretty cute. And I think with a bunch of them in a wreath or on a frame, or even just a couple of these on the table, they're gonna look really cool. So make as many as you want. This only took two of them or half of an egg carton. So I could have four from one egg carton or eight from two. So doesn't take too long. The hardest part was the painting. So if you really like how these turned out, give this video a thumbs up, share it with a friend, make them with a friend. And remember, if they look really good, take a photo of them, post them on the Winfield Public Library's Facebook page. They would love to see them. And guess what, guys? I will be seeing you for summer reading this summer outside. It's going to be so much fun. So many great projects Miss Nujo is planning. So I can't wait to see you guys this summer. Bye, friends. Yeah. <laughs>